Geeks love our coffee, but we treat it so badly. Better coffee today on Tip A Day. I love coffee. In fact, I drink way too much of it, but along the way I've learned to appreciate truly good fresh coffee. The single biggest mistake most of us make with coffee, other than putting too much stuff in it, is how we store it. Here's what you need to remember. Number one, raw coffee beans will stay fresh for a very long time, so if you happen to be into roasting your own coffee, and you probably already know this, leave them green until you're ready to roast and drink them. Number two, roasted beans will stay fresh for quite a while, but they do start to lose their freshness as soon as they're roasted. Keep your beans in an airtight container until you're ready to drop them into a grinder. Maximum time in this state is about two weeks. Number three, once ground up, the coffee won't stay fresh for very long at all. I never buy ground coffee for this reason. Instead, get yourself a grinder, buy the whole beans, and you can get a good grinder for about $15 to $20 just about anywhere. Now here's a little bonus tip. While it's a good idea to keep your coffee in an airtight container, you should never store the coffee in the refrigerator or the freezer. Doing so will wreak havoc on your beans. If you have a large batch of coffee and just must freeze some of it, only do so once, no back and forth. The problem is that beans will get frozen and the moisture on them in the freezing and melting and freezing process will get absorbed into the coffee beans and whatever other flavors are in that fridge or freezer are gonna get absorbed into the beans and you probably don't want fish flavored coffee, do you? So just don't do it. As for the fridge, never. Now, keeping your coffee fresh means you'll always have a good cup and hey, the next time you're in Dallas, give me a call so we can go grab some Joe. If you have a tip, tech or otherwise, you can message me on Google Plus at gplus.to slash Scott Ellis or on Twitter at VS Ellis. I'm Scott Ellis. Thanks for watching Tip A Day. Learn something new every day. Never buy ground coffee for this reason. Instead, get yourself a $20. <laughs> <laughs> or one that's more expensive. Yeah.